New at 5, this is the future of policing in Atlanta. Late this afternoon, Atlanta's mayor and police chief announced new life-saving safety equipment for police officers in our city, including vests that will better protect officers. The new equipment won't just keep officers safe, though. It's also there to protect you. Fox 5's Morse Diggs joins us live. And Morse, the vests will be especially important if officers have to respond to active shooter situations. Yeah, let me give you an example. A couple times a year, law enforcement goes inside the Lenox Square Mall right behind me to practice active shooter drills on the off hours in the middle of the night. Now, when they do that, the federal and state officers, they have the stronger vests and the helmets. APD, not necessarily so. Now, that is about to change with the assist of a major corporation. Recall that city leaders in Dallas and Baton Rouge watched with horror last July scenes of police officers being executed with no warning. Here in Atlanta, the police chief and the mayor may not be able to predict what can occur. The world is changing in dramatic ways, literally in the blink of an eye. Prejudice and hate can be unleashed at any minute by anyone. But they are marshalling resources to provide public safety workers with greater protection through their equipment. Wives and mothers of cops contacted Kasim Reed right after those nationwide killings. But I began receiving calls from officers' families that night, and they were concerned about copycats who would mirror uh, the behavior of those that had fired upon officers uh, in Dallas. And so I decided I wanted to do something about it. And then began to think about what happens before our SWAT team arrives. And so we stood up what we call our, our technical field officers program, which gives our officers the, the ability to go in immediately. These are 911 responding officers. This corporate leader responded to the mayor's request for help to match almost one million in city funds to purchase bullet resistant helmets and vests. Georgia Power decided to pick up the tab of $900,000 for the civic contribution. Our men and women in the Atlanta Police Department who serve us all should be thanked and honored for their service. Now, I want to be clear, APD officers, they do have the inside vest wearing those under the shirt. This is going to be an exterior vest, weighs about 10 pounds, and they can take an AR-15. The chief told me those vests have been ordered, and he should get the first shipment in about 30 days. Reporting live from Buckhead, I'm Morse Diggs, Fox 5 News. Thanks.